Hello knowledge seekers, so many again from oil and gas field quality control with another interesting subject. Did you heard about hot bolting? How much you know about it? Let us discuss. What is hot bolting by the way? Hot bolting is a sequential removal, cleaning and replacement of bolts in a flange joint while the system is on service and pressurized. So based on the definition itself, you can understand the hot bolting is considered a high risk activity. There is some confusion surrounding the phrase as there are several similar and related terms that are commonly, sometimes incorrectly used. This includes hot torquing, live torquing, single bolt replacement, live bolting and retorquing to define this hot bolting, but which is not correct. Hot bolting is the most appropriate term. Hot bolting is a term used to describe the technique of retightening or replacing flange connection bolts where a pipe is live. I told you already. While hot bolting is more commonly used term, this can be misleading as the procedure is not always carries out a hot temperature. So it is not related directly with the temperature. Ask me definition of hot bolting. You can refer to Appendix B of the standard PCC1 2019 edition. Hot bolting is defined as the sequential removal and replacement of bolt on flange joints while the unit is under reduced operating pressure. The procedure generally consists of removing one bolt at a time in a flange, relubricating it, reinstalling it or a new bolt and retightening it to a specified torque. Hot bolting can be performed while the unit is online or once the unit is depressurized. Given the dangers involved, it is vital to understand exactly what needs to be carried out. If the intention is to replace individual bolts, not just retighten, using the most accurate term, single start replacement is recommended instead of the term hot bolt. What is single start replacement now? Single start replacement, it is done while the pipeline is still live, often just before a maintenance shutdown. Doing this while the pipe is still active allows critical pipe or connections to be disassembled quicker during the outage. Benefits are significant with an estimated 30% increase in the turnaround efficiency. Single start replacement allows damaged or corroded bolts to be replaced prevents unplanned shutdown, increases the safety, helps towards improved joint integrity, reduces duration of shutdown, limits the number of containment breaks, increases the efficiency of the whole system, replaces old for new bolts before shutdown, and overall it is reduces the cost. Is it safe? No. The dangers of hot bolting include risk of severe injury, in many documented accidents where hot bolting failed, there have been fatal casualties, fire, explosion and loss of equipment and plant. So be careful with this term. If there is no other choice but to replace the bolts or flange uh, bolting on live pumps or pipes, then you should only do so when the permit is in place and with the utmost concern of safety. The reason for the permit is that every piece of equipment is different as in every situation where hot bolting occurs. Every hot bolting operation needs to be fully reviewed and planned before it is attempted. The evaluation should always follow protocols that consider the contents of the line or the type of equipment that is involved. Hot bolting is a controversial approach to tightening or replacing a bolt or flange on a pipe that is live, full of hot liquid or gas. Operating pressures and temperatures. Because hot bolting weakens and structural connection between the two piping units or between pipe segments or industrial pumps, the pressure within the pipe must be at a prime consideration before hot bolting occurs. Follow the protocol for the pipe pressure before attempting to hot bolt. Also consider the temperature of the liquid or gas in the pipe because both the pressure and temperature changes the behavior of the pipe. Flange bolting and the integrity of the pipe joint. 
For most pipes, hot bolting should never occur when the pressure within the pipe is above 60% of the safe recommended pressure of the pipeline or for the liquid involved. Inspect the flange bolts and the flange itself as a part of engineering review before hot bolting. Never using hot bolting if the flange bolts or the flange show signs of corrosion because those pieces are weak and may not support the added pressure when removing or loosening a single flange bolt. Since it is the topmost priority here, so let us discuss some safety. Safe hot bolting on an old flange connection can reduce these concerns. Unknown remaining bolt tension after a long time in operation, unknown conditions of the bolt, unknown conditions of the gaskets, unknown how the gasket will act under increased or decreased load, failure of bolts during hot bolting operation on the adjacent bolt, unknown external loading, unknown how much force is needed to remove old or rusted bolts, changes in the operating parameter like flow temperature. All these risks are expected during hot bolting. Example, in 1992, an explosion and fire caused several fatalities and destroyed many of an oil refinery in Sodgaura, Japan. During the explosion, debris weighing 1,800 kg or 4,000 pounds were ejected over 200 meter height. One of the causes was identified as incomplete hot torquing or live torquing. This was due to lack of competency of the staff and an inadequate job safety analysis. So you will see the hot bolting is regarded as a high risk activity. Therefore, it should only be done by experienced and qualified personnel and only after thorough risk assessment and job safety analysis. Hot bolting clamps. Before replacing the first bolt, position the clamp as in the illustration I will tell you now to secure the existing flange connection. Depending on the product, pressure, class and temperature to use a hot bolting clamp is certainly recommended because a safe replacement of the bolt is thereby considerably guaranteed. As you can see in the picture, the blue bolts are too long. This is of course an example to better illustrate the result of hot bolting with a clamp. Hydrotight more safe TM clamp used for single start replacement 4 bolt flange. Clamps are also available for large flanges with more bolts. This is an aspect how it is available in the market. You can approach Hydrotight company to have this clamp for your work if it is required. Here are the applicable standard ASME PCC1 Appendix B. This covers the definition of hot bolting and related terms and ASME PCC2 Article 3.11, the most complete guide on single start replacement. So you can refer this standard if you are planning for a hot bolting and go through all the safety aspects, JSA, before you do this job where there are more potential safety hazards lying. Thank you guys. If you like my way of teaching, please share and subscribe and inspire me by hitting the like button. Ending the topic for today, signing off, Soman.